Ladies and gentlemen, from Ipswich, Massachusetts, home of the fried clam, the fools.
Uh, this, is, uh, this is pretty much a favorite place for us to play. Uh, always have a great time here. Um, hang on a minute. Yeah, we have a set list here. We don't call it that. We call it a menu. We may not eat everything on here, but I think we should do this next one. Okay. Uh, this was off uh, some album a long time ago. You may or may not recognize it, but give it a chance.
I need to bring a book up here. Would you, uh, would you bring one, please? Oh, this is Sally, by the way, who handles all the merch over there. Sally! Thank you, Sally. I forgot to uh, bring. Thank you. About to bring my much talked about book up here. It's much talked about by me. <laughs> um, this is the second book I wrote. This has all the naughty bits that I left out of the first book. Uh, you should just buy it to see who's banging who in the, at that time in the band. Um, and you know, it's kind of cool to sell stuff to an older crowd because maybe you bought it and read it and forgot about it. So. And then you have to buy it again. Now, who hasn't read this book? The whole place, huh? Yeah. That'll be 20 bucks. Okay, uh, you're probably going to forget that Sally is over there. She's got all kinds of stuff. She's got t-shirts, CDs. She's got my books. And uh, other stuff. Uh, pairs of Fernalia. Because you probably want more than one. Uh, anyhow, I know you're going to forget, so we wrote a song about Sally. It goes like this. Having said that, I'm going to do that right now. Here's the deal. Uh, when COVID happened a few years ago, I wanted to go someplace safe. So I moved to LA. <laughs> and within a very short time, I got into a lot of trouble. I, hang on, let's relive that. Hang on. Uh, this is me. By the way, this is the Mike Gerard action figure. It's not a toy, it's not a puppet, it's an action figure. Uh, you can get this at Walmart. The embarrassing thing for me is when people buy this, uh, the first thing they do is pull down the pants and they go, Oh, no junk. <laughs> well, I do have junk and uh, we made an arrangement with Walmart. Now you can send away for the attachment to the Mike Gerard action figure. I must say it is pretty lifelike, although it is a bit small. <laughs> Anyhow, so I'm just kind of walking around in LA, just hanging out. Apparently I'm waving to people, uh, but, who, but who wouldn't wave? <laughs> I'm walking down the street and I see someone who looks familiar on the opposite corner. I think I know who that is. Who is it, Rich? It's Ashley Simpson. By God, she still looks great. Well, apparently it was a windy day, though. But, uh, anyhow, uh, I look at her, she looks at me. 
I start walking over towards her. Apparently, I couldn't get too close, but then... Uh, we start talking, we hit it off pretty well. Uh, she said something to me like, Are you in a band? I said, uh, Yeah. Well, pretty soon we're walking down the street. Just two kids out for a good time. <laughs> ah, yes. So we get back to her place and uh, we made some small talk and she was like, uh, blah, 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 blah. I was like, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. whatever you do when you're making small talk. Um, <laughs> Pretty soon we're like, uh, Even I feel unclean now. <laughs> At some point, however, the band came to take me back home and uh, they put me away for a while. In a place, I think it was the home for the extremely nervous or something. But uh, I got some interesting fan mail while I was in there and some of it was uh, quite derisive, but some was uh, pretty supportive. And this next bit of fan mail, we liked it so much, we put it to music. And if you're having a hard time, maybe this song will help you.
let's do it again. Do, 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 do. It's a night for beautiful girls.
time to peek around the old Shirley crap. Are you with me? What do people call yourselves? The Shirley Tonians or Shirleites? Or... We'll work on that later. Uh, we don't come around here. We come to a little town in Tennessee, a little town called Buttpoke. You know, it's a small town surrounded by hills. It's tough to get in and it's tough to get out. After a couple generations, you're kind of coming into your own, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Thank you, Shirley. I do. <laughs> it's small towns. This is all about what happens when your mom plays spin the cousin one too many times. <laughs> Pretty soon there's a big hairy monster walking around in the woods. And no one wants to take credit for it. It's a song about love, L U V. Love gone bad. <laughs>
Thank you very much for being understanding. We're going to do a song now about life as a spiraling force moving through the universe. Unencumbered by modular time concepts. You know, my dad used to say something to me I'll never forget. Shut up! He said, son, if praise was large, you wouldn't have reached too big a pain. I know about that, but I know this. Life sucks, then you die. <laughs> Thank you. 
choices in your life. Thank you for choosing this tonight. Uh, yeah. You going to take a picture of them? Hello. Okay. Call out your name. One at a time. <laughs> yeah, if you can squish together because it's just a... Yeah,
Good night.